So last time I covered my movements to parry 46, I got a lot of positive feedback, but I also got some feedback asking me to help limit the recoil because they're not the best at controlling it. Now, as you guys know, I'm very good at controlling recoil, so that build kind of suited my playstyle perfectly. I get it though. There are some people that are still learning how to control recoil, not familiar with recoil patterns in general, and they do need a little assistance with some certain attachments to improve that. I still have a very fast mobility style superi here. You guys are gonna find a ton of success with that has a much easier recoil pattern to hit medium range fights. Let's get into it. For our first attachment here, you're gonna want the Rescue 9 stock to increase tactical sprint speed, movement speed, sprint speed, and recoil control. A large part of how this weapon is so aggressive is going to be this stock. So I'm gonna share these statistics for you guys and hide my camera. 12% to the movement, 9% to both sprint and tactical sprint speed. You absolutely fly around the map with this attachment. Another very important attachment when it comes down to aggression is the Phantom Grip. So we're getting sprint to fire and aim down side speed at the sacrifice of only flinch resistance. When you have an aggressive weapon like this one, Flinch resistance is basically nothing. You're not shooting across the map, meaning you're not gonna be flinching really whatsoever. You're gonna be up close and personal and in their face. So we're gonna be getting 10% there to the ADS, 22% to the sprint to fire speed, at virtually no sacrifice whatsoever. For magazine here, I have the 40 round mag. At the end of the day, it is a preference. You guys can use whatever you want here. You could go with the 30, you could go with the 20 if, you're, if you want to, I guess. At the end of the day, it's your preference. Choose whatever you want here. Another attachment to increase your mobility and aggression is the DR6 hand stop to increase ADS in walking speed, sprint to fire speed, and movement speed. It's not going to be on the scale of the stock or the rear grip, but at the end of the day, it is going to help your cause greatly. And as you can see, 4% through the movement, 10% to the crouch movement, 6% to the ADS movement, 9% to the ADS and sprint to fire speed. Definitely helps your cause. Like I said, not greater values than the stock and rear grip, but a good attachment nonetheless. Now here's where the recoil comes in. We have the trebuche break. It's gonna give you gun kick and recoil control. And you may be thinking, it can't be that much, right? Like it can't be better than some of the other ones. Oh, wait till you look at this. 25% to the gun kick, 15% to the horizontal and vertical recoil control at the sacrifice of damage range. We still have a great damage range at almost 17 meters and 5% to the ADS. We still have a great ADS, 184 meters or milliseconds great attachment here when it comes to controlling recoil now personally i do prefer my more aggressive style of build but for the people struggling with recoil this one attachment really does change everything so as always here's all of the attachments on the screen if you guys needed to pause and copy this down i did just unlock obsidian for this one so you guys go down in the comment section let me know if you guys have any obsidian weapons here in modern warfare 3 or even one trick this is not the easiest challenge to be honest it's a lot of play time to unlock one trick in obsidian but I really do like it. It looks pretty dang good. Here is also the rest of the loadout on the screen if you guys wanted to pause and copy this one down. It's just a parry, so we already know. I'm gonna go crazy. This thing's broken. Probably the most used weapon in the game right now. I've been playing a lot of Rebirth, and I've been playing a lot of multiplayer, and I basically the only weapon I see, to be honest. Definitely controls the meta right now, so give this one a try. Let's get into it. Make sure you guys hit the like and subscribe button for me. Hope you enjoy. So I do play a lot of maps in this game, but if there's a map that you guys play that I particularly don't play very often. I want you guys to go down in the comment section and let me know. That way I know to try to get it into the rotation at least a couple times. Any maps you guys want to see me play, you just have to tell me. Of course, that's not like, uh, it's not like I don't play a lot of maps, but I know there are some maps that people have asked me to play in the past and I'm just not a fan of them, but I will do my best to drop a DNA bomb on them. So again, if there's any maps you guys want to see, just go down to the comment section, tell me. And I'll work it into the rotation. So the Saperi obviously is the meta SMG right now. Got insane movement with this thing. And on top of that, damage range is also pretty good. So we're over on Rio. This is kind of the perfect map for it. This is what this and like Greece are like my favorite maps in the game. They just play really well. They play like, how do I put this? Classic COD maps. Typical three lane, nice and forward in the sense that they just make sense. You know what I mean? No, I didn't think you were gonna chase me. All right, Max, you're my nemesis now. You're getting the meat smacked on the forehead. Mushroom stamp style. I'm coming for you. Okay. Oh, he stuck me. Good throw. It's Max. Freaking Max. Oh, Max is going to get it. 
I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be his father really quick. There he is. That's Max. Changing mags. All right, Max. We ain't playing these games, brother. Max wants me. He wants me dead. I think this is a... Uh... That is a uh, redeploy, but I don't know who that's for. I guess I'm going to destroy it. Oh! Okay. I know it's... Whenever I get shot at, I know I'm getting chased in this lobby. Because there's Max. Max just loves chasing me. There he is. Yeah, not this time, Max. Teammates are got my back. I am two kills here. Off of my VTOL. We ain't choking. I mean, we might choke. But I'm going to make it my mission to not. Let's get around the back. There we go. VTOL's in. Let's find out where they're spawning on me. Okay, we're going to drop that middle. And now we're going to shoot around the back. And we got the advanced. Okay, that is huge. Yeah, Max. Yeah. Um... Got a UAV to hold on to. I need to go this way. That guy on next. That guy's on next, so we'll leave him alone. All right. I'm about to lose this advanced. So I want to get this UAV in. I got a VTOL. That's good. We're going to hit that now. There's a lot of ghost users in this one. Advanced UAV. I slowed down a bit because I know Max is going to jump out of nowhere and just smoke me. Thank you for coming, Max. And I die to a freaking Claymore in the spawn. Okay, here's that for you. Thanks for coming, Max. You hold that with pride for me, pal. DNA bomb. On your forehead. Thanks for coming. Did Max leave? Max left the game. What a weenie. Homie couldn't take the smoke. Can't take the heat. Get out the kitchen, pal. You know what? I don't care. That one was for you. You want to play play silly games, you're going to get silly prizes. Ooh, that thing was kind of good, actually. I think I had no recoil. He hit markered me with a sniper. That's unfortunate. Well, I didn't expect that. Homie was just plopped in the corner. Oh, we're losing. We're, yeah, we're going to change that. Oh, 
Thanks for coming, Tony. Tony Baloney. Requesting recon flyover. Copy. UAV is Enemy chaos. Don't fuck with my team. Sun tags out. Get lit up. Get your head in the game, kid. Changing mags. Enemies inside the perimeter. They're right there. You won't need recon overhead. Reload. I'm trapped in between a rock and a hard place. Stuck in between two fights here. This guy's behind me. Okay, now we should be good. I just went I just teed up. Teed up for the boys in blue. Yeah. God, I'll never get tired of that DNA bomb. It's so satisfying being able to continue the game. Holy shit, playing with salty. Maybe that guy knows who I am. What's good, Brody? Yeah, not much. Watch videos all the time. And we got a fan. I guess I well, out yeah, that, now you're going to be UAV in a video. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I helped out with that UAV, huh? Right. Thank you so much for the help, brother. I appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah. I was hoping you get a nuke on it. You got a nuke or what? Brother, I already dropped two DNA bombs this game. Hey, shout out to Centipede, freaking homie, helping your boy out, locking a double DNA bomb, man. Hey, if you guys ever run into me in a game, don't even hesitate to just say what's up. You know what I mean? Don't even hesitate because I love interacting with you guys. I will. It's humbling every single time somebody says they know who I am. The Call of Duty community is so big. It is absolutely humbling. Whenever I get the opportunity to play with people that know who I am. Humbling, truly. So me and Centipede are gonna lock in this W. Get your head in the game. Drop them. Two feet. Requesting recon file. Alright, time to lock in the W. They're gonna be right here. Oh, oh I didn't expect four. We're at 105, brother! I'm gonna lay right here and be a sneaky little centipede, actually. All right, so they're gonna be over there. There's gonna be one guy on me. Nope. I choked. Oh, we gotta win. Oh, we gotta win. Help me get there, team. Let's get it. Oh. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. I don't know where this guy is. Jump the hill, jump the hill, jump the hill. All right. We're on the last push here. I should be able to safely rotate. Let's see. We got the lead. I 
I can't lose. Oh, we can't lose. We can't lose. I'm dead. Oh, no. No, no, no. This is not good. We, we need one point to win. Oh, I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you kidding? <laughs> Bro, I almost went crazy if we lost that one, man. In 22. Oh, slaughter. Brother, we almost lost and my heart would have been broken.